and 1540 double G. Right, what's happening around town tonight? In the east, you've got Dragon, Checkers, Goulburn Street in the city, till 2 a.m. tonight. You've got Jupiter at French's, Oxford Street, Darlinghurst, and the Double J concert tonight, Cold Chisel, Studio 221, off Clapton Place, Darlinghurst, 8 till 9. Of course, it's free. The amount of Australian music played on Double J, mm -hmm. has that been the aim of the station from the start to basically promote Australian music? Yes, it has. We've always felt that we should promote our own culture, uh, our own music, our own films, our own theatre. As we're basically a music station, our main aim is to uh, encourage Australian music. Right. So what which is the aim behind this campaign. Right. What do you think of the new quota system dropping it? We can both get in on this one if you like. And is Double J no, playing more report. than the quota? Yeah. Uh, I think it's absolutely absurd. We would support as a station a lifting, of, uh, an increase of the quota, I should say. Uh, we are pa playing the 20% now slightly over. From their first album released yesterday. It's um, oh, half past two on Double J. Kerry Phillips with you now till four. Right, so Australian music is the basic reason for the promotion for October. Would you like to fill us in on that, Ted? What's the story behind the album? Where did it come from? Well, the story behind the album is simply that we have uh, an amount of money allocated to us to go into promotion and normally stations go into uh, the hard media, into TV campaigns or into uh, redecorating garbage bins and bus stop seats. Yeah. And uh, traditionally Double J's put its money back into the people that we think count, i.e. the listeners. This time we're looking at putting the, the money back into something that's going to support the music industry, uh, both the musicians themselves and, and the re recording industry and the retailers. It's something that has benefit for everyone. It's simply a campaign called Buy One Australia and Get the Best of Double J Free. And what we've done is produce from the last two and a half years of Double J's live concert recordings a best of album, an album that contains people like Skyhooks, ACDC, Rene Gaia, Dragon, Jefferson, John, it just goes on and on. Now the idea is buy one, get one free. If you buy an Australian album, you can get the best of Double J free. But why do you think the, the ABC has not established other stations like Double J in the other states? Have you scared them off? No, I think it's a mixture of... Um uh, various bureaucracies involved in the broadcasting industry not actually confronting one another and doing something about it, all of them being passive rather than active. It will happen one day, it's inevitable. Do you think the other commercial stations are doing enough for Australian music? No. And what can they be doing? A lot more. more. <laughs> <laughs> A lot more. Um, the material's there, play more. Yeah. The, Record more. Still the old problem of the restricted and limited high rotation playlists, that's fine for breaking a hit but it doesn't really expose a lot of people to a lot of music and so a lot of music goes unnoticed and unheard which is a disgrace right. sure. well good thanks very much we just say in closing Sorry. that uh, Go right ahead, it is a free record <laughs> it is a free record a record that you can get only by purchasing an Australian record so get out there buy one Australian and get the best of double J free y'all know what it takes to leave but do you know what it takes to take you home, Double J will take you home.